how to multiple and put Chinese words list into Anki and get the sound with the characters in the flashcards. The first step is to prepare what you want to input to the Anki card. Um, you can use the Excel. For example, this is my word list. What am I going to? This is what I'm going to input into Anki. So I have a three columns. The first column is characters. Second column is pinyin. Third one is uh, English. What is important is that we need to save this word list as this kind of file. But before that, you need to delete the first, the first line, the title one. Just delete it. So now let's save it as CSV file and then choose this one. This one and then okay. Mm. Okay, so I have it here. This is my new word list with this special file form. So we already finished step one. The step two is prepare for the tools. First, let's open Anki. And we need to add the add-ons, which can help us to make the sound of the characters. The add-on code is this. We just need to add it somewhere. We found tools on the top. And then choose add-ons and choose get add-ons. Here is a code. Let's put the code here and press OK. Then you will be installing the add-on. But since I already have it, so we just cancel it. After you download it, it will show you here. Create a deck. Just click on Create Deck on the bottom of the app. So give it a name, Test. Okay, here it is. So click on it, and you will see here's nothing. No flashcard. So click on Add. Okay, now you can see here is a type. Here is the deck. We need to create another new type for it. So click on here. You can see we have a lot of types, but we will just click on Manage and then click on Add and choose the basic one. OK, give it a name, Chinese with Jen. OK, and then just uh, close it. You see here is Chinese with Jen, choose it. Okay, now we have the new type, which is Chinese with Jen, but we only have a front and the back. So we need to edit. So click on fields, delete it. And then we need to delete it as well, but we can't. So let's just rename it. So the first field is character so just type in character characters okay and add another one the field two is the pinyin the pinyin column so type pinyin the third one is english english Okay, that's all we need. So close it. Now you see you have characters being and English. Now we need to click on cards. Here is the front page. So you see nothing here. Here's uh, the answer part. The, first, the front page we want to see the characters. And maybe you want to also see the pinyin. So just type here. Mm, okay, and in here, the back template, this part, what we need to 
you want to see is the English translation. So just type English here. Okay, that's it. And now if you want to add the sound, you just need to click on the Add TTS. So click on it. And let's choose. Okay, now let's try to find the Ting Ting. Chinese voice. And this is the speed. Okay, we don't change here. Insert. So just close it. And now let's click on File. Click on Import. And choose what we just prepared Chinese words list. Open it. Okay, field one is the character, field two is pinyin, field three is English, and field four and five is, is, is nothing, is empty. So just ignore it. Now import. Okay, already edit. So just close it. Now you see in the test deck, we have new 36 Flashcard. Let's try to study now. Okay, but we have the characters twice. I don't know why. So let's, let's try to click on the fill under the the card. Maybe we just delete the character. Okay, I think that's okay. Okay, 人气博人气博主, popular blogger, 创办, 创办, establish.